Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying three new Kashi Chewy Nut Butter Bars. I have the Salted Chocolate Chunk, the Coconut Cashew Macaroon. And the Almond Snickerdoodle. Uh, these were $3.48 a box at Walmart. There is another variety that uh, we could not find, but for $3.48 a box, I told Kevin, I said, we'll just try what we have. That's a lot of bars to get through. And, uh, and there are five bars in a box yeah. for, for that money. And I do have to say that the two of these had dollar off coupons. Oh, that's awesome. So, that's so really you can good. get them for a dollar off if you if you happen to find them with a coupon. That's great. Okay. They, I guess because they're yeah. really, they're trying to. I can tell this one yeah. had one. I think they all had one, but only two of them actually had the coupons on them. So I just I didn't realize it and got right. a box that didn't have a coupon on it. Right. So I swiped it. Ah. <laughs> well, <laughs> we've done that too. If we're buying the product anyway. And then you just get one and use it yeah. with what you because because if you're going to be buying it, it's not like you're cheating or anything. Right. Um, okay, these are gluten free, fair trade certified, uh, non GMO. They're made with are they made all made with almond butter? No, this one's cashew butter. This one's almond butter. So and these, this one doesn't say it's fair trade certified either. Oh, okay. so some of them are, some of them are. Okay, but they're all gluten free. Right, all gluten free. Okay, I'll just read Whatever you. that tea thing is. Transitional certified. I have no idea what that means at all. Never seen that before. Okay, I'll read you about this one. Uh, this is the salted chocolate chunk. Uh, one bar is 150 calories. That might be the same for all of them. I'm not sure. Okay, what is it? 150. 150. 150. 150. Okay, they're all. And I can tell you what transitional sir. It says it right there. It says these bars are not organic. They're certified transitional, an initiative we helped create to support farmers transitioning their conventional farmland to organic. Why do they need support? Well, farmers have to go through a three-year transition period to be able to apply for USDA organic certification. That's three years of implementing organic practices on their land without a return on their investment immediately. So they're less motivated to make the change. So these are the people basically that are going organic, but there's a three year gap there before they can say they're organic. So right. they're, they're organic without being organic. That's understandable <laughs> that they, yeah, that they would need help. Yeah. Yeah. So that's cool. That's yeah. I think that's idea. really nice. Okay, so salted chocolate chunk. And it says more about that program too, if you, if you, if you get them, you can read about it. They oh, look wow. good. Good chunky. Oh, it's not as thick as I was hoping it would they be. They smell good. There we go. There's quite a bit of stuff on top going on. It's a very soft bar too, or it feels soft. Yeah. I'm call them a yeah. flavor. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay, I was gonna say, I taste <coughs> coconut. Excuse me. <coughs> Do you taste coconut? I do a little bit. Mm -hmm. I taste the coconut almost immediately. And they do use um, cold pressed coconut oil. And this has dates. A grain went down the wrong way. <clears throat> it has whole grain oats, brown rice syrup, almond butter. You know I like I, that. I think I, it's I like it too. It's, it's got a sweet flavor to it. It's got a good caramel flavor. Mm -hmm. uh, the a lot of these bars, the oats kind of overwhelm everything. Mm -hmm. This one doesn't. It, you get a really good mix of flavors there. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I and like it's that. strong. That um, yeah, that caramel topping is really strong. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that a lot. And I like the texture of it. There's mm -hmm. a lot going on there. All right, these are the um, coconut cashew um, macaroon. 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 And they're made with uh, cashew butter. Like yeah, but they still have almond butter. They have um well, it's got coconut all over the top. Cashew butter and almond butter. There you go. Quite a bit of coconut on the top. There's the bottom. 
There you go. It's got like little, looks like little blobs that's on, on top too. I don't know what that's in. Don't you think that's the butter? Oh, I I like that one too. Mm -hmm. Very sweet. Super sweet. Mm -hmm. For 150 calories? Mm -hmm. That has yeah. a lot of flavor. You really, you feel that coconut, mm -hmm. the it's, strands. It's got a good mouth feel. The yes, textures and stuff like that work really good together. Mm -hmm. There's a chewiness to it, mm -hmm. but there's also a crispness to it when you get to the coconut and some of the, some of the grains in there. Yes. That's good. I think I like that one. Actually, seems sweeter than the the caramel one does. It does, <laughs> which is surprising. Yeah, it does. It seems a lot sweeter. I mean, like candy bar sweet. Mm -hmm. Like you're eating a Snickers or something. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's that sweet. That would definitely satisfy a sweet tooth, and for 150 calories, that's not bad at all. And Kevin, if you're on a diet, that would be. I think that would be an excellent diet. Yes. Uh, yes, it would be. We like those strands of coconut. We like to build them, like chew on them. Yeah, that, no, some, that people, has a lot. some people don't like the feel of the coconut. Right. Because we've heard people on TV saying, I really don't like the coconut. I love whole pieces of coconut. I'm yeah, we like to fill it. All right, this one is the almond snickerdoodle with almond butter. Um, and snickerdoodle is kind of like a cinnamony kind of flavor. Cinnamon sugar kind of uh, mm -hmm. flavor. Because some people have asked you before, why is snickerdoodle? Yeah, and it does have cinnamon. Wouldn't you describe Snickerdoodle as all that kind of cinnamon? Mm hmm. That looks good. It does look good. Looks like it has plenty of almonds. If you hear snoring, it's not one of us. It's Guido over there snoring big time. Yeah. <laughs> He's sawing logs over there. Guido is our 12 year old pug, by the way. <laughs> he is sawing logs. Wow, you get the cinnamon immediately. Mm -hmm. I don't remember what the other one was that we didn't get. That one's just okay. That one's not my favorite. Out of the three, that one's my least favorite. Yeah, I agree. When I have cinnamon and sugar, I like to have either equal parts of cinnamon sugar or more sugar than cinnamon. Yeah. That's me. That's like a raw cinnamon. This has more cinnamon mm -hmm. than, it, yeah. This is like, like you said, it's like raw cinnamon. It's like uh, you've made yourself a, a cinnamon toast and you put the cinnamon and the butter on the bread and then you forgot to put the sugar. Yeah, or very, very little sugar. Right, right. Yeah. yeah. And now if you like that, that powdered ground cinnamon mm -hmm. flavor, those are really, really good. Mm -hmm. there, there are lots of flavor there. The texture's still good. Um, they're just not, it needs a little sweetness to balance out it's all the It's the least sweet, definitely, out of the Yeah, yeah, because cinnamons take, kind of take some of that sweetness away. It's not bad at all. There's mm, absolutely nothing wrong with it. And I think the more you ate, the more you're gonna get mm -hmm. used to that. Oh, yeah. um, I still think it's a really good bar. Um, and I'm impressed. I'm impressed by all these by Kashi. You know, we've, uh, it, Kashi's been hit or miss for us. Sometimes uh, we really haven't liked some of the cereal that we've tried mm -hmm. uh, years ago. Um, but I really, really like these bars. Um, now, if you have three dollars and forty-eight cents, and you're only going to buy one, you're going to buy the coconut. coconut cashew macaroon all day long. Uh, I think I would do that too. Yeah, yeah. All oh, the caramel, the salted chocolate, um, salted chocolate chunks. Which it's it doesn't very say, good. You know what? I thought it said caramel. It doesn't. It says salted chocolate. No, salted chocolate. I'm saying, yeah. but it tastes like caramel. It does taste like caramel. It it it. It very much tastes like a. I think it's the nut butter, whatever that nut butter is. I think it. Uh, it does taste like uh, caramel and if you've tried these you can let us know if you feel that way too Because if you hadn't told me what that was and I ate it, I would think that was caramel. It did, yeah, because it really does taste like caramel So but anyway, my favorite is the is the coconut, the coconut and Definitely the a one. very close second would be the salted yes. chocolate Yes And, and then the cinnamon would be further I down. probably wouldn't get this one again at all um, I'll eat them 
Yeah. But I won't. I wouldn't buy them. Right. Yeah. Yeah. We'll definitely eat them and not buy them. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the review. I'm going to have a picture of all three of these at the end for you. And thanks for watching.